Well, I've taken some of the um, uh, the newspaper uh, cellulose out of this thing, and it stank like high heaven, and had a bit of a sulfury smell to it. And I think, well, how the heck can you have a sulfury smell when you're supposed to be just cellulose, something that's supposed to have no <laughs> sulfur in it? So there's a bit of a conundrum. First of all, to start off, is the sulfur smell really a sulfur smell? Uh, something that climb uh, a point that Climo made in one of his papers is the smell of H2S actually the smell of H2S or is it something similar or something else? So this is quite an eye-opening for that one. Anyway, I've taken some of this and I'm trying a new thing which seems to be having some effect on my Sarah Senior. Um, so we'll see how we go. Um, I'm, call I'm calling it uh, milk of ash cream. So, uh, so we'll see how it goes. And if this greens up and starts growing liverworts, well, I think we've got the connection, or the liverwort connection, anyway. So, um, and yeah, I think it's all kind of come together. I think I think this is the final thing, and this is just a simple way of, um, you know, <laughs> I'm having a go using this just on its own. You know, creaming it up and setting, you know, cuttings and things like that. But I think this is going to be the simple way of doing it. So if we get our lovely, um, uh, what do you call it, a cyanophyta and everything, and then start getting liverworts and things, I think, well, that's the answer, basically. Um, you can just get something as simple as, um, you, you know, yes, newspaper cellulose cat litter, put this on it, and that's it. That's all you have to do, I think. And, uh, you know, just cheap, simple, easily available, it's cheap, simply, easy, easy, easily and available to make up and put the two together and that's it, that's the CP revolution. That's what I wanted, something really cheap, simple, easily available, anywhere in the world, anyone can make it up and it just bloody well works, that's what I want to see. So hopefully this will eventually, I don't know how long it's going to take to go green, but as I said, because of that smell there's probably billions of organisms having a good old chomp through there. It's taken probably some time to actually get them to go because we set it up quite a long time ago. But um, anyway, hopefully this is it. This is the cheap, simple, easy, you know, putting the whole bloody thing together. Uh, you know, two steps basically. Something to replace your peat and something to make it better than peat, I suppose. So, okay, over now.